Ah, there you all are. A very good morning to you. Friday morning, of course. Good Friday morning. And it's Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster, just with you, saying dinky-doo. We are, of course, live on Facebook Live, the world's top broadcasting platform. I thought I'd just pop up and say hi to you. I hope you're all having a lovely holiday. Also to mention that Good Friday to Christian people is when Christ made his journey to Calvary and up to Golgotha, the place of the skull for crucifixion. Uh, so it's a pretty serious day in the Christian calendar, but of course Easter marks the new year everywhere. So it is very much new year, I say, and I think new year should be transferred to Easter because Easter really just means Esther, the egg, the new life. It signifies the new life and it's lovely to have a bit of a break, a bit of a holiday, time to spend with your family, time to send out a bit of love to everyone. And let's hope we have some peace at Easter. I know that world events are being dominated by aggression at the moment, but don't be distracted. Don't take your eye off the ball because of this, because there's so many good things happening. You and me are in the world for a start. That's a good thing. So there's a cause for celebration right away. Now, good morning, says James Stark. Uh, hello to my mum, Jean. Happy Easter, says David Wright. Stephen Rooney's watching. All the best, Ma. From all at True Radio, says Henry Pollock Newton. Mick McFarlane's watching. Dinky Doo. Good morning, Scotty. Dinky Doo, says Mick. Richard Mackay is watching. How marvellous to have you all with us on Good Friday. And of course, what you can do on Facebook Live, make sure you take the link that you're watching me on right now and spread it worldwide so that everyone knows that Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster, can be with you just like that at a moment's notice. Now, of course, uh, good morning, Dinky Doo, Rimmer Pursuity is watching, Dinky Doo, Rimmer, and uh, everybody's sharing the video. I give thanks for that. That's marvellous stuff. It's just after 11 o'clock on Good Friday morning, and I thought I'd pop up with a Good Friday special just to tell you what's happening. Now, those of you who don't know me, of course, Alien Life Formed from Another Planet, you're very, very welcome. And I am Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster. The big show, the global show, the one everyone's talking about and the one everyone is watching and listening to takes place on Sunday evenings at 10 o'clock sharp. 2200 hours British summer time and uh, of course that will be around five o'clock tea time in America on a Sunday night and this Sunday marks the 30th program 30 fantastic programs with me Scotty McClue we're opening up the Skype again so we are going to make it a phone-in program because I want to take um, interactive calls from your good selves so that we can discuss our points. Lots to talk about, of course, worldwide. Lots to talk about locally. Lots to talk about globally, national and international. And that's the beauty of this program. That's the beauty of having Scotty McClue on your televisions right now is because we can talk, we can chit chat. Mary Cart is watching. Good morning, Scotty. Have a great day, says David McGuinness. And you, David. Lovely to hear from you. Good evening, Mr. McClue, says Remo Pacitti. Well, Remo is in Australia, and uh, that's why he's saying good evening. So I say good evening, Remo, and good day. Uh, there we are. Fantastic morning, Scotty, says Yvonne. Boyd McLennan, how marvellous to have you all on here. And as I say, spread the word. Uh, once this video is finished, share it and share it and share it and share it. And wish everyone a very happy Easter. Very, very important. Uh, Paul Wright, dinky-doo, Paul, lovely to hear from you. And um, who else have we got? Oh, he's giving out the number for one of my old radio stations. <laughs> Tremendous, because... I've had the privilege of working on 35 radio stations, local to national. Tremendous. Four television stations, including the British Broadcasting Corporation. Tremendous stuff. And there's a lot more coming because I haven't even scratched 
the surface. Do you think Scotty McClue would make a good Doctor Who? No, 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 no. There, you tell me. There we are. And dinky do, Scotty says Andy McCrory. Dinky do to you, Andy. Lovely to have you with us, Morsi Puffin. A fine, fine fellow's watching in Australia. Let us know if you're watching round the world. Where round the world are you watching? That would be tremendous. Now, little bit of housekeeping. Scotty McClue is all over social media. Please never ever pass by on the other side. Never ever ignore me on social media because I am here for you. I am here to serve. I've not been given the world's title, uh, the title of the world's top broadcaster for nothing. And top broadcasters do other things. They broadcast on radio and television. They broadcast across social media. If you can get on Periscope, I've been doing one or two broadcasts on Periscope. So if you can get on Periscope, then follow Scotty McClue. Join me on Periscope and we will look at some of the broadcasts there. So it's a broadcasting platform, one of the world's great broadcasting platforms. And of course, Twitter. Follow me on Twitter at Scotty McClue. Big, big room for development on Google+. Plus. Very important. So you can go and follow me on Google+. Plus. Join the Scotty McClue community and we'll build all these things up. Do you see what's happening here? A massive global broadcasting platform just for you, the people. And also what I'm hoping to do is launch an independent free media. Now, when I say free, I'm looking for a small amount of money just to improve facilities and to get it launched. Otherwise, it's very, very frustrating. So if all of you can help, say, Scotty McClue has amused me for 25 years. He's worth two pounds, and I'm going to send him two pounds. Or he's worth a hundred pounds or a thousand pounds, depending on what you're comfortable with. Because what I'm hoping to do is finance a new independent media. And obviously, there are going to be costs involved in that. So if you can help out, the reason I've done it this way is if we opened up shareholdings, then people say, the greedies say, mm, I'm not sure I got a great return on that. You know, I invested, you know, a hundred thousand pounds. In, uh, in in that and nothing's come back as yet but all that kind of stuff that just makes people upset so what i'd rather we did is all of us give a small amount voluntarily because that's what we want to do so if you want to do that you just go to gofundme.com forward slash scotty hyphen mcclue and there it'll come up or gofundme uh, go to gofundme.com and put in scotty mcclue and up it will come. We were looking for five million pounds initially. I've reduced that to half a million for now. Not because I don't think we'll get the five million. I'm pretty well 100% sure we'll get the five million. But it does take time for people to waken up and say, no, 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 I, I, I like Scotty McClue. I'm going to give him a few pounds and get the man on the road with this equipment and with building his broadcast setup. So there we are. Good night, Scotty, says Morsey. Um, on the nutty scale of nutty McNuttiness, how nutty is Scotty McClure, says Steve Webster. Oh, it could go up and down on the nutometer. There is no doubt about that. On the nutty scale of nutty McNuttiness, how nutty is Scotty McClure? Take the show worldwide, like the Grand Tour, show from different countries. Every week, says Remo Pasiti. Remo, a very, very sensible thing. Actually, I pause while I mop my brow. I've been working outside. I'm still dressed for the outside here. And um, obviously, it's very warm in the studio, even at 11 o'clock in the morning. David Russell's watching. James Fawns is watching. Dinky do to you. I say, lovely to have you with us. So... Uh, two sources of funding there, GoFundMe and uh, GoFundMe.com forward slash Scotty hyphen McClue and also PayPal. A lot of you prefer to use PayPal. Uh, you'll get the PayPal link on the Scotty McClue website along with the GoFundMe link. So wwwscotty McClue.com and that website has been visited by over 10 million people to date. 
So you're in good company there, and you'll see at the top the little icons. Now, please don't pass by on the other side. You know, be like the good Samaritan and think, no, no, I can I can give Scotty something. It's not a problem. I, I can afford to lose a fiver or whatever. So there you go, and we will get some uh, decent uh, equipment and build a set for you. And uh, then we are up and running. This becomes the world's top channel for uh, tuning into. Tune in to the World's Top channel with me, Scotty McClue, saying dinky do, and join me on all the other social media. If you're a business person, get on to LinkedIn. Follow me on LinkedIn. Come and join my group on LinkedIn. Come and join me on LinkedIn, because I'm linked into some very, very big people on there, and you will like that. And uh, also Twitter, as I say, follow me, at Scotty McClure. Periscope, we're building a platform there, so you'll see the Periscope broadcasts. One went viral yesterday, a little one. Number five, you'll see with a blue jumper, a navy blue polka dot tie with white polka dots. And um, it lasts about five minutes, and uh, you will see me on there. And that went viral yesterday, so keep that one going. Also, YouTube. Now, this is very, very important. It's all important, but this is absolutely vital. Get yourselves on to Scotty McClue's YouTube channel. Scotty McClue's uh, YouTube channel, Global Broadcaster, right? Get yourselves on there. And um, there's about 216 videos you can watch for your edification and your delight and your education and delight. So there we are. Very important. John Simpson's watching. Dinky Doo, John. Fine, fine fellow. Dinky Doo says, James Forbes, I would be comfy with five grand, Scotty, if you could possibly see your way into those extremely deep pockets of yours would be much appreciated, says George Buns. Absolutely. George, if you want to send me five grand, feel free to do so. That will deepen my pockets. Dave Hemsley's watching. Dinky doo to you, Dave. Marvellous stuff. If we could share the video, that would be tremendous. So, as I say, please don't pass me by on the other side. Think of the feeding of the 5,000 from little acorns the great oaks grow. And uh, get yourselves on to gofundme.com forward slash scotty hyphen McClue and stick in a couple of quid or fiver or something like that. It's all set up for you and you can read about the background to it and you can also look at the um, the video the videos up there as well so excellent stuff and uh, Ad uh, adam mitchell's watching dinky do adam lovely to have you with us of course a very good morning from scotty mcclue to all of you the world stop broadcaster broadcasting live on facebook live one of the world's great broadcast platforms so there you are. And uh, also we'll upload this video to YouTube so you can see it there. Now, can you also subscribe to YouTube? I need a thousand subs, a thousand subscribers. And I've got, I think, um, 820, something like that when I last looked. It was over 800 anyway. So I'm needing a couple of hundred of subscribers. So if a couple of hundred of you can go on to Scotty McClure's YouTube channel and click subscribe. That would be a great help. It won't cost you a bean, so there you are. Um, it's just subscribe. That's what it's called on YouTube. Uh, so if you want to get on to Scotty McClure's YouTube channel, please do that. Now, uh, what else can I tell you about? Um, oh, I had a great idea. I mean, I'm no politician, as you know, and I am no um, political animal. I don't have any affiliations with any parties or anything like that. But two points I need to make. I've looked at a lot of social media, and people are particularly nasty sometimes to these wonderful people uh, who are nationalist about Scotland. Now, remember, a nationalist in Scotland is a totally different thing to a nationalist in England. An English nationalist tends to be a right-wing fascist type of person. And a Scottish nationalist, nothing to do with the SNB, just a Scottish nationalist, somebody who wants Scotland to be re-recognised as a nation after 310 years, um, is a kindly, left of centre, thoughtful, intellectual person. 
And we have a wonderful, wonderful leader in Scotland at the moment who's the envy of the world. Most people wish she was their politician. And what's happening is the press are obviously going into meltdown because they are very, very, very scared that Scotland might choose to go independent, which I think it probably will do. And of course, that would remove £40 billion from the UK exchequer right away, and it would mean Scotland would be trading as an independent nation. But have a way round this, pouring oil and troubled waters here, the old Scotty McClue common sense bonnet, dinky do. And my way round this would be, uh, don't put the cart before the horse, don't let's do all this Brexit stuff and take the UK out of Europe. Separate Scotland, right, so that it has its own parliament with full fiscal autonomy, right? So you have two parliaments running. You have a parliament in Westminster, which looks after England, Wales and Northern Ireland. You have a parliament in Scotland, which has full fiscal autonomy for everything that happens in Scotland. You have control of broadcasting in Scotland. Very, very important. Even if that meant setting up a Scottish broadcasting corporation and we pay our license fee to that. And that would be regulated by Holyrood. Very, very important. So you could look at all these things. Now, once you've done that, then Scotland, which is still part of Britain, if you like, that amalgam of countries, Scotland, England, Northern Ireland, and Wales. So you're still part of Britain, but as I say, you are an independent parliamentary state, right? Very, very important. Because remember, Scotland was independent for thousands of years until 310 years ago, until 1707. So you do that, and then that would allow the rest of the UK to trade with Europe via Scotland. So there's a wee thought for you. There's an interesting piece of thinking. And take the heat out of it. Don't get excited. Whether you are, you know, the Prime Minister or the head of uh, the European Union or whatever, don't get excited about it. It's only a change of management. So there you are. So that's something that I think could be looked at. Very, very important. And we'll touch on international affairs uh, perhaps another time. I shall have to push off now. Uh, Luke Jones is watching. And uh, to right, Scotty. Nicola is admired worldwide. And you'll see a lot of things trying to do Scotland down, trying to do the First Minister down. That's just low-life politicking. Ignore all that. If a newspaper seems to be biased, don't buy it. It's as simple as that, right? Just say, no, I am not buying that. I mean, I don't buy newspapers now, unless I'm in them, of course, but um, I don't tend to buy newspapers now. I tell myself a whopper in the morning, and that cuts out the middleman. So there we are. Just tell myself, just a whopper, just wind myself up. So there we are. I misconstrue myself with the facts uh, in the morning, and that saves me buying the newspaper. So there we are. That's what we're talking about there. Right. Um, I shall push off. So quick checklist, of course. Go to gofundme.com forward slash scotty hyphen com. Stick your two pounds, your five pounds, your ten pounds, or your thousand pounds in there. Go to PayPal on the Scotty McClue website, wwwscotty com. You'll see the PayPal logo. Stick some pennies in there. Thank you, by the way, to everyone who has given so generously of their hard-earned. It is very, very much appreciated. Follow Scotty McClue on Facebook. So every Scotty McClue Facebook page, there's a public page with about 5,500 people. If you can follow that as well, follow this page that you're watching me on now. Spread the word, tell, ten to tell, ten to tell, ten to tell, ten about Scotty McClue. Live on Facebook Live, Sunday nights at 10. 10 o'clock sharp. Join me on Sunday night at 10 o'clock sharp. Follow me on Twitter. Follow me on YouTube. Subscribe there and your edification and delight will be made perfect by watching Scotty McClure's videos up on YouTube. So there we are. And uh, to every single one of you, I hope you have a wonderful Easter holiday. 
I hope you have a well-deserved break. I hope that you spend time with your loved ones. Love to all of you in the human race. Love to the outsiders as well. Very, very important. And of course, when Sunday comes for the Christians who feel Christ is risen again and dwells among us in his risen power, I say, bless you and God's love to you. For all of the world's religions, I send love. Remember, religion has never, ever, ever caused a problem in the world. The only problem is a lack of knowledge and a lack of understanding. Remember, there is only one race, the human race, and we're all members of that, including the outsiders. And, of course, remember that everyone smiles in the same language. I'm off now. Shall I sing you the song? Yes. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. A waiter, then, au revoir, and a cheerio. Have a lovely holiday. Happy Easter. And dinky-doo, everybody. Scotty McClure has left the building. <laughs>